What up? A uh, couple things. Got into it with my first planner. I, I, I got into it with the planner today. Uh, they, I'm like, I've been trying to get dispatch back home for like two loads now. And they're trying to send me to New York. They want to repower me to New York. And I'm like, dude, that's the opposite direction. And it's in a fucking city that I don't want to go to. He said, he like was talking to me like as if I didn't have a choice that I was just going to do it. And that's it. So I call my DM and I'm like, this dude like basically is trying to like force this fucking load on me and I don't want to do it. I'm trying, I've been trying to get back home for two loads and I want, I need to go back. I need my home time and I need to fucking get uh, to business class. So I, I'm, I'm tired of them to keep telling me that they're going to send me somewhere and they're not fucking sending me anywhere. They're not sending me where they say they're going to fucking send me after I take these loads where they're supposed to go. So she's like, let me call you back. I'm going to call the planner and blah, blah, whatever. Okay, fine. She calls me right back, and he's like, he's saying you accepted a load, and blah, blah, blah. I was like, he kind of made me feel like I didn't have a choice, you know? So she's like, I'm gonna three away him in. I was like, okay, great. Like that, I don't know what the fuck that's gonna solve. Regardless, bottom line, I need you to take me off this fucking load that you assumed that I was gonna take, and then I need to be dispatched south. It doesn't have to be to Texas. That I don't necessarily mean I wanna go straight to Texas from Illinois. I just need to start heading south. That's what I need to do. Because I'm already coming up on the date that I requested to have off, which is the 21st. It's the 15th. The amount of time it takes to get here to there and there and all these stops and accounting for the unloading and loading, that will send, that will get me back home. It's, I'm like, they just keep giving me this fucking runaround. So this dude's like trying to talk over me while I'm on the phone and I start yelling at him. I'm like, no, dude. I was like, what do I have to fucking do? How many Qualcomm messages do I have to send? How many times do I have to tell y'all I need to go to Texas? Send me to fucking Texas. I don't care how it takes. You guys keep sending me north. You're, I'm stuck in the northeast right now. I'm in this fucking, I'm in like limbo out here. I need to go back home. Okay? Send me home. So I tell, I tell him, I'm like, take me off the load. I don't want it. So now I'm probably on a list of uh, drivers that are going to refuse loads. When really, if they were to check my fucking messages, which they're probably not going to, they're going to see that I've requested on three different loads that I'm ready to go back to Texas. So they're just going to see past that and they're going to see, uh, you know, it doesn't play well with others. You know, refuses loads. Like, you're sending a grad student to fucking New York. Again. Like, after I already told you I didn't want to fucking go back there. So anyways, I got taken off the load. And I just got, I've already got a fucking pre-plan. I'm going up to Wisconsin. I'm going to pick something up and then they're sending me to Tennessee. Then from Tennessee, I'm going to make sure they don't try to fucking... And Okay, so this dude wanted me to repower this other guy, right? He wanted me to repower someone. And I'm under the impression that repowers mean money. You get paid to do repowers, right? This guy doesn't seem to think... He's in planning and he's like, I just fucking read the engine, but whatever. So, he's telling me, he's like, I don't know where this rumor started where y'all drivers think that y'all get paid for every repower y'all do. I'm like, I'm a grad student, so, I mean, doesn't it make sense? That, you know, I've been hearing it every every time that we did a repower, right? We were empty. When I was empty with both my trainers, when we did repowers, they got extra money for it, and my trainers split it with me because we both ran them. So, yeah, it works. And he wanted to make it seem like he didn't want to pay me. I'm like, you're telling me I'm going to send out to this, you're going to send me out to this fucking place and not give me extra money. He's like, oh no, the extra money's the miles. You, you're sitting right now not getting any, any miles. I was like, y'all are Stevens Transport. Y'all got freight, dude. This ain't the only load that's gonna keep me from rolling, man. I'm like, take me off the load, dispatch me south. Send me south. I don't care where, but south. And towards Texas, if possible. If not, south works fine. I'll do east coast, just southern east coast. Send me back to North South Dakota. Send me, whatever, like send me something. Just get me going towards the house. So, needless to say, I finally got my, my pre plan is dispatched now, so I'm fixing to accept it. I figured I'd just make a quick video about how there, you gotta be assertive. You are in control. You are the driver. You can reject loads. Despite how they talk to you, you don't have to take the load if you don't wanna do it or you've been trying to do something else. If you don't feel comfortable going to New York, you don't feel comfortable going over to this other place you've already been to that you don't want to go back to, reject that shit. 
you might get put on a fucking list, right? But then you just you just bug the fuck out of them until they dispatch you, right? You gotta learn. That's what they mean by work the system. You need to be assertive. You you're the driver. They need these loads done. They compensate you or don't fucking do it, right? That's what I'm gonna fucking do. Or put me on a load that's that's due to pick up later. Uh, I can make it there on time. You know, give me a late load, whatever. But I want I want some compensation if I'm gonna be fucking doing these motherfuckers a favor. Anyways, remember just ladies, love it, hate it, fucking ready to take care, and I'll see y'all another time.